So YouTube family, we're in a situation here where Finesse Two Time is kind of in hot water, but even his mom had to respond to the madness of what's going on. You know, 1090 Jake, he dropped a banger. You feel me? Another video asserting that, you know, another rapper is a, a, a tattletella, Donatello tattletella out here. I don't know what to say towards it. I'm researching to see what's true or not, but I'm not going to be fake it to y'all. I don't really care who's a rat or not. As long as you're not in my circle, you didn't do no harm to me and my folks. I ain't going to pretend. And I'm also not going to be fake and say, I don't listen to Gunner. His album is fire. I listen to Gunner. You feel me? So all I can do in this is just play the receipts and play the tapes. Without further ado, let's listen to uh, um, Finesse two times mama and hear what she got to say about all these accusations before we get started i need y'all to hit that like button hit that notification bell thank you for rocking out with the best platform out here the i smoke hip-hop live platform i am dj bless one the best one let's go what a bitch man this crazy how am i snitch and to lay down 15 motherfucking years of their life who snitch Y'all better check that paperwork. Check his paperwork. The f Then I go on these bloggers and look in the comments and it's half of my Facebook friends. Half of you motherfuckers on there. That might ain't never been no motherfucking snitch. The f is wrong with y'all, man? Social media a mess for real. Social media is a mess for real, man. This shit will make you or break you. For real. I ain't snitched on nobody. Now time he went to jail. And he could have. He could have. He could have told on every was involved with everything. But that man laid down. He ain't say shit to nobody. He did his time like a motherfucking man. And laid down. He ain't tell on them. Motherfucker. And that nigga that's out there putting this shit out there. That's the nigga that snitch. The fuck they at my motherfucking house for looking for Ricky. Because that nigga snitch. They told it. He told it on Ricky. The fuck paperwork man all that fake paperwork y'all better start believing that thing y'all see on this blue out man the blue one the red white and blue one all them real talk y'all better stop believing that shit. then go in the comments and comment like you know what the you talking about It pissed me off because my baby been gone all this time and then a gonna come talking about he's snitching. The f that shit got me mad as a motherfucker. I don't f snitching. And a motherfucker went and laid down. Not in the county jail, the penitentiary, the Fed. Yeah. The Fed. My baby ain't never did shit but stood on business. That's it. He ain't never snitched on now, Nah, fuck that. Them went all the way back and went and got him. Picture from I don't even know where you might want to be finesse so bad, you might want some clout so bad, man. So bad, but let me let me keep on seeing. I'm gonna start addressing you, period. And he don't even approve of that. Shit. He like, no, nah, man, that's social media. Them folks gonna say what the fuck they wanna say. Yeah, but a ruffling my feathers. 
Talking about my son done snitched. That's one jacket you ain't gonna put on his back. Say what you wanna say about Ricky Hampton. Don't call him a snitch. That's what you can't do. That ain't gonna happen. Hell no. It's on nobody. Now time he went to jail. And he could have. He could have. He could have told on every was involved with everything. But that man laid down. He didn't say shit to nobody. He did his time like a motherfucking man. And laid down. He didn't tell on now, motherfucker. And that nigga that's out there putting this shit out there. That's the nigga that snitched. The fuck they at my motherfucking house for looking for Ricky. Because that nigga snitched. They told it, he told it on Ricky. The fake that paperwork, man. All that fake paperwork. Y'all better start believing that motherfucking thing y'all see on this blue out, man. The blue one, the red, white, and blue one, all them motherfuckers. Real talk. Y'all better start believing that shit. Then go in the comments and comment like you know what the fuck I'm talking about. Y'all tell me how y'all feel about Finesse Two Times Mom's situation. Do you think 1090 Jakes went over his head on this one? Or do you think he did the right thing and he's actually telling the truth? Now, 1090 Jakes' excuse was it's other people who sent it to him. And he said he does vet it properly, just like he said the 03 Greedo situation. And my personal opinion, I don't think Rich Homie Quan snitched. Because if you watch the Rich, Rich Homie Quan video, he was speaking to his homeboys at the crib at his house. You can even hear somebody say close the door. And on the phone was probably an interviewer or something like that. But you didn't see no credibility of that being a cop, detective, nothing. So that's another thing. I don't know. I'm not quick forward to put that jacket on anybody. Number one, ain't no coming back when you put that jacket on somebody. So it's already becoming an educational purpose, life and death situation. You know what I mean? And I understand it. You feel me? Uh, I, I, I got to just stay with it, man. And I got to watch, you know what I'm saying? Who's who's coming through with what Blue's Clues perspective? And it's on y'all at the end of the day. A mama is going to be a mama bear like C-Mac like to say. 55. But mama bears are always going to protect their cubs. And you can see she's adamant about it. A lot of people are criticizing her and saying she's the one who promotes the behavior of finesse that got him arrested for over 15 years. Not at the one stint, but if you add all of his stints he did it it comes up to 15 years and they put it on her because of her mentality and she should have stayed off the internet that's not my perspective you can't tell people how to react when you go at their loved ones look man y'all tell me how y'all think about this whole situation y'all let me know in the comment sections until then hit that like button hit that notification bell thank you for rocking out with i smoke hip-hop live i am dj bless one the best one salute to all the real and the trill man this situation is a wild one it's wild. Love your family, love your kids, stay blessed.